This is Shepard Humphreys, and some of my friends have asked me about this uh, new tactical flashlight for searching uh, invention that I'm working on and I'm going to bring to market, and have asked if I'm going to patent it. And I considered it, and uh, have decided not to, and just wanted to tell you why in case you're curious. Um, the patent process would be 5000 bucks or so, um, and then that was basically uh, having that intellectual property would say that other people in the United States would not be able to uh, use the stuff I came up with to make their own flashlight uh, like that. Of course, as an entrepreneur, as a business person, I don't want to have people competing with me. I'd like to just control the whole market and be the only person that makes it. That would be my preference. And uh, getting a patent is kind of an easy way to do that. But for those of you that know me and know a little bit about my philosophy, uh, I didn't think that was the right thing to do. And the reason is, there shouldn't really be any such thing as intellectual property, in my opinion. And we can debate this over beer or coffee sometime, but my personal moral belief is that it's probably not a good idea. I came up with a, a good idea here that solves a problem, and I hope a bunch of people are going to want it and are going to buy it from me. Um, I hope that anyone else that's going to copy me will wait a while, let me let me, you know, get get some strength, but frankly, that's that's nothing to expect. If you see somebody doing something smart, you ought to copy them. That just makes sense. So I'm not I'm not going to do a patent. Uh, a patent is essentially, from a philosophical standpoint, from a, an honest, no special fancy words used, a patent is uh, asking another group of people to use violence against anyone else that tries to do exactly what you're doing with, with your idea. And I don't want the government, that third party, to go to your house if you're out in your garage trying to make similar search flashlights. I don't want anybody to initiate violence against you. And I'm not going to pay to have them do that or file paperwork to have them do that. So it's my job to make as high of a quality of product as possible, balance that with price, and uh, figure out what the market wants, figure out what you want, and provide it to you, and uh, take good care of you. So I, I could patent it and probably charge twice as much for each one, uh, but I'm going to go with a much lower price. I'm going to make them myself. I'm going to have father-in-law make them, try to find other small-time manufacturers to make them in the, the garage or the, the spare bedroom workshop, and uh, eh, we'll see how it goes. That's the long and the short of why this idea is not uh, something I'm going to patent. And now that this video and others like it are out there, they're considered prior art, and uh, no one else can patent this idea either.